Cannonvale State School is the first Reef Guardian school to become the official keeper of a beach and mangrove area and are now galvanising their community to help protect these important areas. With the support of our students, the community and the council, we have officially adopted Cannonvale Beach and the mangroves opposite our school. Our students learn about the importance of the environment through the curriculum and this is our real life classroom where they can do practical activities to learn that what they do on the land affects the reef. We conduct regular cleanups of our adopted beach and mangroves so that the marine life isn't injured or killed by our rubbish. We do water quality testing to make sure that the water entering our adopted beach and mangroves is healthy. We would like our adopted areas to be natural and we'd like to remove any plants that aren't native in the future. We have begun to revegetate our creek, school and beach. Cannonball students are taking on the job of protecting our Great Barrier Reef. Tangroves in the Mackay Witch Sunday region want to ensure they maintain a sustainable industry. We're all making sure we're looking after the local environment and the World Heritage listed Great Barrier Reef. Over the past 15 to 20 years, the cane industry introduced Green Cane Trash Blanket, which greatly reduced sediment and nutrient runoff onto the Great Barrier Reef. We are now striving to become even more environmentally and financially sustainable by implementing legume fallow crops, sediment detention basins, minimum tillage operations, the use of new technology and machinery, and stronger research and development. Many cane farmers in our region have implemented farming practices that minimise fertiliser and chemical usage. These practices have both good economic and environmental outcomes. We are also taking measures to prevent erosion, meaning there is less sediment washing into the local waterways. Cane farmers in the Mackaywitz under region are making large strides to improve land practices that will help improve the quality of water entering our Great Barrier Reef. Let's all do our bit to ensure we're playing our part. Many graziers are implementing best management practices that are increasing the productivity of their pasture while reducing the amount of nutrients and soil lost to creeks in the Great Barrier Reef. We're undertaking a number of on-ground initiatives to ensure that soil and nutrients stay on the land where we need them. To help minimise soil erosion on creek banks, we're currently implementing off-stream watering points. This means the cattle drink from troughs and there's no need for them to directly access the creek. Other initiatives include stock and strategic fencing, which enables us to separate land types, control stock movement, spell pastures and maintain good ground cover. These practices all help minimise the loss of soil and nutrients from the land. Combined, they make good sense, environmentally and economically. We're committed to ensuring a sustainable property and a sustainable environment for our future generations. Grazing is helping to reduce erosion and improve the quality of water entering the Great Barrier Reef. The Mackay Whitsunday NRM Group has been working for the past two years on a water quality improvement plan for the region. This plan will help improve the quality of water flowing to the Great Barrier Reef. Our region boasts some of the most valuable natural resources in Australia and it is fortunate that we live on the doorstep of the world famous Whitsunday Islands and Great Barrier Reef. To help protect these natural assets, we have developed a water quality improvement plan. We worked extensively with community and industry to ensure we have a plan based on the very best available information. We know that if our agricultural and urban land managers are resourced, then we have a suite of cutting edge management practices that will deliver significant water quality improvements. In the long term, these improved management practices will not only improve our waterways and the Great Barrier Reef, but will also benefit our social and economic well-being. The Mackaywood Sunday NRM Group, local industry and community are committed to ensuring the Great Barrier Reef is protected for future generations.